Assalamualaikum to our beautiful madam. Today we would like to present about our group project which is about security program regarding on data breach on Astro. Astro is one of the largest media entertainment company in Malaysia and Southeast Asia. Uh, Astro operate in four key areas which are publication, media, digital, radio and pay TV. Okay, mission and vision for Astro is they want to create an organization which is, will exceed to the customer expectation in quality, service and cost control. Um, this project is about data breach that happened in Astro. This issue has happened twice in less than two years, which is they are in around 14 months like that. Okay, um, there are unauthorized access to the customer my card data and details, but it's not included all the customer financial data. They only uh, access to the customer detail like name, IC number, date of birth, and also uh, customer address. All the customer's data that they have access, they sold uh, the data on the dark web. As well have to access to the data privacy and data security. It is because part of the data privacy and security are related to the controlling user data. It will protect valuable data and protect the data against hacker. Next, Astro must update their software regularly to keep all the software, application and program patched and up to date. Okay, uh, last one is Astro must comply to the Data Protection Data Protection Act to ensure prudence and integrity in, hand, in data handling. Other than that, this act will help to build user confidence and trust toward the Astro. Next, we move to the proposed policy. That uh, proposed policy, we have decided that Astro must comply to the Personal Data Protection, which is which is under Ministry of Communication and Multimedia Commission (MCMC). This is because there are many benefits that Astro can get from this policy. A minimum standard that comprise that that comprise three uh, personal data protection principle, which is security, orientation, and Astro need to investigate the data breach to determine any method entry or damage that contribute away to the hacker. Astro need to analyze on how the hacker get access into Astro systems and check the customer's information. Astro create a cyber security playbook for numerous organizations to identify infected system. Last but not least, after design on the cyber security playbook, Astro has agreed to make awareness program with one the security company to detect and to expose all the dangerous plans. During the maintenance process, policy committee will monitor their staff to ensure that Astro are following the systems by record their activities. Next, this issue can relate to what happened towards Astro which there is a breach of information regarding to their customer's information. The Malaysian Communication and Multimedia Commission and Department of Personal Data Protection have been notified by Astro and they are working together to address this issue. Furthermore, to protect all employee and customer's data, the Information Management Department must work closely with the human resource department. They also need to ensure the policies are procedure are all aware. They need to be active in field of information security. They also need to provide uh, education to the employees about the importance of information security. For developed scenario part, Astro said that less than 0.2% of its customer are impact and the business is in the process of contacting them. Astro set up to 60,000 Astro IPTV. Customer details were leaked in June 2018, which were directly provided by Maxis Broadband Center and Berhad. Astro also feels challenged when there are still parties found to be brave enough to sell pirate films open. This table shows the gun chart of Astro program. The duration for Astro to complete all the scope is 26 days. Alright, next we move to the financial. 
of the project uh, this is the financial as you can see there are uh, three sections of the expenditures which is the estimated income uh, travel and accommodations and estimated estimated expenditure we move to the estimated income first uh, in estimated income there is included uh, tasks such as allocation from uh, Salcom Ezeta Brahat, allocation from Security Malaysia and external contributions uh, the total estimated income is about uh, 33,000 we move to the travel and accommodations for travel and accommodations there are two uh, two budgets to be displayed such as uh, 15 participants or spectators which is 50 ringgit per each person and a lunch for 20 for one day which is about 200 ringgit and the total total travel and accommodations is only about 950 ringgit we move to the uh, es estimated expenditures uh, there are many uh, there are many things to be listed in the, in the estimated estimate expenditures which is the speaker fees, banquet, hall, consolation price, publicity and marketing, technical, protocol and others. And the total estimated expenditures is only about 29,800 ringgit. And the total of the uh, budgeting is uh, about 60,750 ringgit. All right, next we move to the uh, the best solution and approach in information security program. First, we go to the computer security incident handling. Computer security incident handling is an alert for an incident uh, that occurred and from the engagement from the incident response team. This computer security incident has become as one of the important components in information technology programs. This is because incident response is a method of handling any security problems and issues such as security incidents, breaches, and also cyber threats. A good incident response plan will allow and help users to identify, to minimize the damage and reduce the cost of the cyber attack effectively. In other hand, perfect incident response plan will help users in finding and fixing the cost of the attacks to prevent it to happen again okay we proceed uh, from, the, from the last point which is the computer security incident handling there are three uh, main points in the computer security handling which is the incident detection reaction and follow-up uh, in incident detection as the main issues is the data breach in astro there are few ways that can be used to detect the data breach first the organizations should not adjust anything on the suspected systems because if there are any changes in system, it will make the problem become worse and lose the evidence. Organizations must collect the available evidence. All the evidence must be included, all the incident analysis and even post-incident actions. Next, companies should step back and take note on every action to ensure that your organizations do not miss anything important from the systems. When organizations notice the breach, they need to verify the findings via Threat Intelligence Source, National Computer Security Incidents Response Team, and many more. This verification allows organizations to contain the incidents and recover back the data. We move to the reaction. Within the data breach, uh, the business units must build up approaches or strategies that addresses occurrence both internal and external to enroll the response team. During the suspected that breach of the data, business unit will be mindful for any fines and judgment or le legitimate expenses and costs related with the occasions. Organizations will repay the costs uh, brought about other trade divisions as a result of the occurrence. Besides that, the director of IT framework capable for taking after the occurrence disclosure Announcing and reaction strategies recognized as a coordinate by the Astro Brahad. For the follow-up, when occurrence has resolved, organizations need to follow up to ensure that their data are safe from the hackers and all the malware. Alright, next we move to the awareness and training. 
this program is one of the efforts in creating an awareness and training for the students, graduates, undergraduates, and even for everyone. This program will help the ASRO in reaching their vulnerabilities and operation in a safe direction where this program will give them a high impact. This is because this program is about a data breach and how to prevent data breach from the occur in your organization. ASRO security issues occur from the customer's record and data. Customer's data should be a private and confidential, but if the data breach, it will harm the ASRO itself. Security awareness and training program could be a solid advocate but, uh, to changing the issues around. There will be a security framework and systems will be overhauled to the miss currently current security methods and location to, of the framework. Now it's about the security consideration in computer support and operation, where this involves system management and system external tasks that support its function, such as maintaining documentation. In Astro, they use a help desk which is made to deal with customer relationship management or CRM issue. Other than that, any precaution need to be enforced and remind to our worker to prevent the social engineering from occur in Astro. They should not open email in the spam folder or email whose recipient they do not know. Use reputable antivirus software and our worker should be checked by getting a social engineering test done by an outside party. Plus, system administration can, however, be made safer and easier with legacy privilege account lock. Legacy privilege account must be closed because this will probably offer the old system admin staff room to access the current system, even though they are no longer functioning under the organization. As for the physical and environmental security, the element we have avoid and warn people about the problems such as stealing activity against the data and data of the company customer. LM installation will help information and data from the user in a protected position as it will help to warn people about the unauthorized access. For the identification and authentication, where it involves identification, authentication, password, advanced authentication. In the context of Astro, the best approach to efficient information management for Astro for the identification and authentication is through advanced authentication, where each client should have their own personal account for their own use. If they want to subscribe to any of the network, customer can build an account on the official website of Astro. As for logical access control, it will help in allowing Astro to limit access for those with a bona fide business need to information, information asset and other tangible asset. Astro can restrict access control to any third party to secure customer detail, such as name, address, email address, credit card information or personal information. The access criteria involved in the directive use administrative control such as policy and training aim at prohibiting certain user behavior in the Astro. Deterrent to prevent or deter an incipient event that may occur in Astro. And lastly is the access control mechanism. Access control mechanism is a role-based control which is linked to the role performed in Astro by a specific user. Whereas task-based control are linked to a specific mission, initiative or responsibility. The role-based and task-based control make it easier to retain control and constraint, especially if the person who performs the role or task often change. The administrator simply assign the corresponding access right to the position or mission, instead of continuously granting and revoking the privilege of individual who come and go. Audit trails. In audit trails, the use of log review process is the best solution and approach for an effective information security for Astro. The log review process depends on the system and the type of event being flagged as research may require a different approach. For example, when investigating event, event involving Astro user account, they need to ensure that the data obtained can be stored properly. Suggestion, the event analysis log can help Astro solve its problem. 
Payment Card Industry Data Security Standard TCI. This log can provide a knowledge for best for for the future research and can be used uh, at in conjunction with the incident handling process. Next is about cryptography. The first one is temporal key integrity. Temporal key integrity protocol is a security protocol used in the wireless networking standard. The protocol was designed by Task Group and the Wi-Fi Alliance as an interim solution to replace WAP without requiring the replacement of legacy hardware. This was uh, necessary because the breaking of WAP had left Wi-Fi network without a viable link layer security and a solution was required for already deployed hardware. Second is key recovery. A key recovery encryption system also known as recover recoverable encryption system is an encryption system with a backup description cap capability. A recoverable encryption system can be divided logically into three main components which are user security component recovery agent component and data recovery component. Third is virtual private network VPN. A VPN uses encryption to hide the content from the unauthorized observer or people who may or can access the public traffic. Astro can set up a network connection on the internet or internet within the company and send encrypted data back and forth securely. This will help in minimizing the opportunity and chance to for the information that they are storing and sharing to be breached by an authorized person from outside or inside the company to open and access uh, the file. Lastly is key management. Astro employees should know to and with whom they should communicate if there a problem occur. The Astro management uh, that know about the InfoSec in the company should this with generating, exchanging, storing, using and replacing keys as needed at the user level. A key management system will also include key server, user procedures and protocol, including cryptographic protocol design in the Astro company to minimize the potential of the data breach. For the conclusion, we provide with three solutions for Astro which are complies with the personal data protection. It have access on data privacy and data security and update software regularly so the server can identify any malicious program that may be running with unique authentication to ensure that the organization know exactly who has access to the system and assign each user with unique access password. We recommend that Astro choose to comply with personal data protection. It is important for Astro to enhance public confidence and trust with ongoing enforcement and to ensure the prudence and integrity within personal data. That's all from us. Thank you.